Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Farming Simulator 22. Continuing our Elm Creek start from scratch run. And I am hooking up the trailer because I think I realized something. It's a little silly. Maybe you guys have made a comment and I just didn't see it. But I think this drop-off location for the honey only holds one pallet. And I didn't know that because this pallet looks kind of small. But... I think there's only one pallet there, one pallet spot there, and I think we have wasted a whole bunch of honey by not picking that up sooner. Maybe I, I don't know. I honestly don't know. If you guys know for sure, let me know. But it doesn't. It didn't look like it's been growing at all, and I feel like it's been enough time that it should have grown by now. So, oh well, not the end of the world. Uh, again, one of the best ways to learn is to make mistakes, and. Uh, yeah, so there you go. So hopefully that starts producing honey again. We'll find out here soon. And if so, well, then we'll know that we, we missed out on a quite a bit of honey. But again, it's not. Life goes on, right? So anyway, so there we go. Drop that off and we'll keep an eye on the honey thing over here and see if we can get any more here coming up soon. Other than that, uh, no contracts right now that are worth picking up, or at least not worth picking up in my mind. I don't like these cultivating contracts really all that much. And the plowing one, uh, I don't like that one either. I was looking at the used equipment. And there is a piece of used equipment here that I was tempted to pick up. Uh, this Kloss um, Harvester is 43000 bucks. Now, it's a a slightly less of a... It's a less of a harvester maybe than the one we've got. It holds a 1,000 less liters. And the header is a meter less width. The meter, the one that we have, is six meters wide. This one's five meters wide. However, if we were to trade the one we've got in, we would get like seventy something thousand dollars for it, uh, and like seventeen thousand dollars for the header, and we could buy this and a brand new header for fifty-two thousand dollars. So it would make us forty thousand dollars just to trade those in. I think that's worth doing. I'll be honest. I mean, it's a good it's a good harvester here. We don't need this much. It, at the time, it was the cheapest harvester we could get, I think. Uh, or I, like I was just kind of playing around with things. I don't think there was a lot of other options. I guess technically the Rostamosh was cheaper, but um, we didn't have these cost ones, I don't think, yet. I don't think those were were uh, downloadable um, because I think they added those in with the 1.2 patch. So and this, so this is the one we're looking at, this cost right here, 70500 and it, it drives faster. So if we ever had to take it somewhere, it drives a little bit faster. There's that. But I feel like it's the right moves to pick this thing up. And yeah, a meter less width. But is that really going to matter? And a little bit less on the, uh, the how much it can hold. But again, is that really going to matter on the size of fields that we're running with? Well, where you can get like 40000 bucks back and have that money to either pay off some of the loan or, or do something else with. I feel like that's the right move. Yeah, there it is right there. I mean, it's, it's brand new. We, we got that recently. I think that's exactly what we should be doing. So, we don't have anything in here, right? Nope. Um, so, let's go ahead and sell both of those. If you guys think it's a mistake, let me know in the comments, like you usually do, which would be good. But I think it's the right move, because, again, we don't need that much right now. And it's a really good price for that combo. Um, so, if we come over here, we can customize you. Apparently we can change the design, what we do. Uh, I am going to change the chassis color because make a little bit more, you know, a little more contrast. But other than that, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go with this. Um, buy you. And then we want to go grab the header for that. And just to make sure I get the right header, we'll come in here and go to the combinations. You can even get a header trailer, which I might actually do just so we can, well... It's not that big of a deal, but it would let us, I think it might let us drive it on the road more easily. But for our benefits, it's, it's not going to matter that much. So there we go. We got us a new harvester. I've actually used this harp. Look how beat up this thing is. Oh, I actually love that. It's so beat up looking. Um, Let's get this thing repaired up. How much is that going to cost us? $50,000. Uh, 1200 bucks. That's not bad. 
We could even repaint it for 5600 bucks. But, ah, I kind of like the character it's got. It's been loved. Nothing wrong with that. So there we go. We just made a big chunk of money today. $42,000 today. Just by being a little bit smarter with some of the equipment. I've definitely used this one before. I used this one on 19 quite a bit. Um, yeah. I'm pretty happy with that, I think. I mean, a, a meter less width. I mean, it makes a difference. But I don't think it makes that much difference. I mean, if it was like three meters less or something like that, I, I, yeah, maybe I wouldn't do it. But I think in this case, it's okay. Although I did just realize something. This one can't do corn, can it? I mean, not that we're going to be doing corn, but I was looking at the wrong things. Um, but yeah, there was not a, a corn header in there. Huh. Interesting. Huh. No, we can do corn. Where's the header for the corn? Maybe it's just under headers and it's just not connected for some reason. Uh, is it going to be under class? None of those. I think I'm running into somebody's car right now. Is it going to be one of these Capellos? No. No. I don't know. I mean, it says it can do corn. Beats me uh, which header you can use to get do corn with. Yeah, don't know. Sorry, dude. Kind of just scratched up your paint, didn't I? You scratched my paint. Look at this. It, it was brand new a second ago. Yeah, I don't know. If you guys know how to do the corn, let me know. We're not planning on doing any corn, but it still would be nice to know. I might even pay back a big chunk of the loan, honestly. Pay back 10% of the loan. All right, that's that. Um, any new contracts or anything else we care about? Nope, <sighs> nothing new at the moment. Um, let's just fast forward. We're gonna go about 120 speed for right now. Let me check the, we're actually gonna check the honey drop off spot over here. No honey yet. Maybe it just takes a while. Um, what else do I want to check? Oh, prices. Uh, go fast food restaurant. Please get above, I don't know, 1050, 1075. I might actually be willing to sell. Truth be told, I might just sell it as is. Just to, although it's not like it's doing anything. It's not hurting anything. Just sitting there. Yeah, really, none of these are really worth worth doing at the moment. Come on, honey. Or it could also be just messed up because of the way the shape is. Let me see if I can... I'm going to slow down time again just so I don't miss anything. Let me see if I can fix this shape a little bit better. Uh, what about some sort of like... Or maybe it's soften, I think. Um... Increase the strength quite a bit. I think it's getting worse. I think it'll still pop out just the way it is, but uh, let's go a little bit bigger. I wouldn't mind seeing the corners just so I can for sure see how big it is. Not really quite getting it, is it? 
Trying to pull over a little bit of the elevation from the pit. Come on. I mean, I could lower a little bit, but I was hoping this would slope in just nicely. We're spending a little bit of money, but it's not too much. Yeah, just not getting it. Um... We're lower, but I don't. Uh, I want to do lower. Um, slowly. <laughs> Where is the rest of that thing? It is definitely not showing up. All right, well, let's go back to the soften then because we just made it worse. Whatever, I won't overthink it. I'll just keep an eye on it. Hopefully it starts dropping honey again soon. hole still there it is very much still there come on soften up the hole please No, it's just really bad. We're going to have to level it then. It's not really leveling, is it? I get it's not very strong and it's not very big, but I would have thought it would have leveled. Is it because I'm standing there? Is that why nothing's happening? Oh my goodness. I bet that's exactly what's wrong. <laughs> oh, I'll be alright, guys. I think that was exactly it. I was in the way. a little bit of a hill it's not terrible and that thing's now up in the air I'm not sure if I like that I'm spending too much time on this but it's bothering me right I mean sometimes do you ever guys ever have anything that just bothers you and you're just like I gotta get this fixed because it's just gonna annoy me as I walk over there and mess myself up again Still got this block right here. I don't know what to do. Whatever. I'm just not going to overthink it right now. We'll figure it out later. It's just not getting rid of this right here. Is it because of the stuff that's around it? Like the beehives and stuff? That it's just not doing anything? Like it literally, that really bothers me. 
gonna try it one more time. Um, I'm trying to soften it again. We go full strength. Uh, what if I just change the brush shape? We just, I don't know if that'll make a difference, but I just want to soften this stuff in the middle here. I don't think that did anything. It's still got that little hump there. I would have thought soften would just like take this entire square and like even it out better. And it's just not doing that very well. Whatever. All right. I've spent enough time doing that. I apologize, but it bugs me. All right. Let's see anything else over here. Nothing yet. Let's go ahead and go back to speeding up time. We've softened our pit a bit, which is not that big of a deal. We were going to soften it eventually probably anyway. I'm assuming the beehives are messing with some of the way this land is settling. We're going to go a whole day without a good contract. I think we are. Ooh. <laughs> Give me a little grape and olive tractor. Teeny tiny tractor. It's a good little tractor. Wrong map. Well, we're not getting much of anything today, are we? I also haven't got any honey today. I must I bet I messed this all, whole thing up. Somehow. We'll give it another hour here, but that is gonna be it. There's the saddle trailer. We got the saddle tractor on one of the maps the other day. I think it was the, the Swiss map. And now here's the trailer for it. Can we combine maps, please? All right, we're not getting anything. We are going to go ahead and fast forward to December, I guess. Or we're going to pay off some loan first. Um, pay off 10% of our loan. All right, if we get to the point where we can pay off all of our loan... That'll be a really good day. Now, uh, paying off the loan's fine. I'm still, still okay with that. But we do have just about enough money to do the bakery. Which, oh, we got more honey now. Confused. Um, so apparently it can do more than one, but... <laughs> really confused. Okay, whatever. I'm not going to overthink it, but we've got more than one now. Maybe because of the way it was sloped, it was messing with it. But anyway, as I was saying, um, we we can do the uh, bakery now. With um, we're not, It's no point in doing it now because we don't have any flour. But we're going to have enough money to put down the bakery here soon. And I think, I think we definitely want to try and think about doing that. Because turning that flour into uh, bread would be even more lucrative. More honey. Speaking of honey, what is the price? Ooh. Cereal factory is at a really solid price right now. I mean, we don't have enough as much honey as I was hoping we would have right about now. But we'll go zip over there and drop this off there. Might as well get something for it. See how much we get for just three little crates. Uh, that's the cereal factory right there, right? Yes. All right, 
Zip on over there, my friend. Um, let's check contracts. Big old cultivating contract, which does allow us to do the other cultivating contracts without much effort. So tempting. Maybe not the 342 ones. Maybe not even this. Probably just these two. 31 and 43. 31 is right here. 43 is down here. Oh, that's a weird one. Cedar. <laughs> oh my goodness. What is with the grape stuff? A great tractor and a great trailer. <laughs> Guess we're supposed to be doing our raisins now for our cereal. Oh, goodness. We got a grape harvester in that list too. I actually don't know what I would do. That would be so weird. Um, do I want to borrow the duo in the cultivating contract right now? Not super, really, to be honest. Um, I get that it's you know it would be worth a decent amount of money, but I just don't like the cultivating contracts. They take forever. I guess we could use the other tractor. Make this go a little bit faster. No biggie. I'm assuming we're only going to get like 1300 bucks for this. Think of how much money we could have gotten if we'd been spitting out honey like we we're supposed to. Twelve ninety. I was I was pretty close. Ten dollars short of thirteen hundred. So not a lot of money, but again, we I think we bought we probably lost at least four or five pallets of honey, judging based off of how quickly it came out once I fixed that spot. So um, there's a good chance that uh, you know we lost a decent amount of money. Not a big deal. Not the end of the world. I mean, I could do those contracts because what else do we got going on? But I don't know. It's not fun just doing no contracts for a month. Although the honey we just sold just about pays for our our lease for the or our loan interest for the month. I'm actually going to park you over by the honey just so we can be ready to pick more up as needed. Really not sure how fast it's going to start spitting out now. All right. Um, hmm. I mean, the thing is, I don't think we're going to get any other types of contracts. So this may be all we've got available. I mean... Might as well. Where's 63? That's way over there. Don't really want to do that one. Oh, better pick up the weight. <laughs> 
It's a tidy way for this massive tractor. Get you over here to field 43. Hopefully you don't have too much trouble doing that one. At least gives us something to do. I'm going to go back to fast forwarding time a bit though. Hope at least another contract of some sort comes up. Although I don't know what kind of contract we get at this point that uh, we don't already have something for. Um, yeah, I really don't know if there'd be any other types of contracts that'd be worth doing anything. There's no harvesting there's no planting there's no nothing during this month technically i guess we could get a bailing contract because you could technically harvest uh or do grass but unlikely so um i still can't believe we're getting all the grape stuff are we looking so just all these cultivating nothing else all right we're gonna go put a cut in the video for now we'll come back when uh in a bit, um, I'll get started on this cultivating job, and then we'll be back. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout-out to our first channel member ever, Telrenar. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.